Mmm, that's good. Frangipani. It's a winner. Look at this. Can't beat that. This is, um, I'm just over there, been hanging there for a few weeks now, uh, amongst the rice fields. It's uh, 1.30 so sun's beating down. The beach is, Anbang Beach is just over there, Hoi An, uh, still here. And um, I got some new wheels, yep, been talking about it long enough. Went and brought some new wheels. Uh, City 300. Uh, I'll show you what that is. Uh, another crossroad again. You know what that means now. Decision time. And uh, I've just been hanging, chilling. And um, it's been fun. I've uh, been here seven months now, just ticked over seven months. And um, look at this, Vrangipanichi. I was uh, riding through here a couple of weeks ago at night. Um, I like riding around in, in the dark. And yep, <laughs> uh, don't go off the track. Things can happen. Things can bite you. Um, this fella can't bite anymore. Check him out. He's perked. <laughs> but um, there's some biggies around here. S there's some snails that are as big as my hand and, and frogs. Um, I don't know who'd win that one. But yeah, look at that. It's, it's a cracker, man. It's, it's, it's rich. So I'm riding here at night and I, I rode around through here and I didn't, I didn't see the tree. Um, I've seen it before, but it hadn't flowered. And I could, I could just smell it up large. So I'd done a yui here and stuck my nose and nose in the dark of night and just sat here for a while. Uh, wicked fragrance, frangipani. So no, I've got, some, I've got some new wheels. Here it is. It's what we're going to look at. Here you go. Yeah. Check that out. Now, you know I normally have a box on the back. And um, I've been... Researching, uh, but I haven't done the motorbike thing yet. We'll get to that later. Uh, I need wheels. I'm in another place now. I've upgraded a little bit, and um, they don't have a free bike, so I had to buy a bike, which is good. Um, I just reinforce my own independence. Uh, yep, it's another um, item that um, that I've uh, uh, that I possess now, and you know what I think about possessions. But I can walk away from this. I can give it away. If I really have to bail for whatever reason, you know, political or I just I just want to move, um, and I don't want to take it with me, I'll give that away. If I I don't want to muck around selling it. If someone wants to buy it, that's good. But there we go. Uh, Twenty. What is it? Three times seven to twenty-one speed. Um, no, that's no big deal. And um, the funny thing is, I um, I should put this up somewhere. Uh, where can I put it? Uh, I like to put my camera in the trees, but um, I might drop it. So I've been looking at this in another bike, a mountain bike with um, 40 millimeter tire, thicker tire. Well, that's all good around around town here, uh, and it's a softer ride, and I think less punches. But um, I, I'm going to ride this up to Da Nang soon, which is it's only 25 kilometers. Um, I've done I've done 54 in one day on a single speed up in uh, Nimbin, Tamkok, uh, my favourite place. I'm going to go back there. Tranquil. Tamkok, T-A-M-C-O-C for anyone that's coming here, uh, 90 kilometres south of uh, Hanoi. Go there. It's a good place. That's where all those jagged mountains are. Um, so I was looking at this. I narrowed it down to this in a mountain bike, and I thought, no, I'll get, I'll get the skinny tyres um, because uh, they're slightly harder ride, but for distance, it's less friction on the ground, and I think that's important um, 
when you're doing some covering some miles less friction more speed easier easier ride so uh, here it is now I went in and out of a, a, a particular shop here in uh, Hoi An a few times and nailed it down to two I had the money in my pocket I had five million dingalings dong in my pocket to go and buy it 300 and 300 Aussie 330 New Zealand um, 230 US less than that not, not a lot of money and um, so I went back and between sort of 12 and 2 here people like to uh, get on the horizontal um, go to sleep uh, either close the shop or just sort of disappear and that's fine no problem um, but I was ready uh, business is business I would have thought and um, Oh, well, I want to go and buy my bike now. Just make a decision. I struggle to make decisions, but uh, yep, money in my pocket. Anyway, the young fella come out that had been treating me pretty good, giving me free water, and uh, he was he he wanted to lie down. Um, he said, "Come back later." Uh, I don't come back later. So that upset the plan a bit. Uh, so I had I had the bike I was on from the hotel I was staying, a bloody good place. Um, I'll promote that one in in uh, Hanoi here. It's called Five Coconut. Number five. I'm not there now. Number five, Coconut. Uh, out in uh, Kam Chau, Kam Chau Province, three kilometres from Old Town. That's where I am now. And um, so I went a riding, and uh, I remembered I'd got a flat tire on the bike that um, I had from the hotel. And um, you've seen me riding in my gym, gym videos a couple of months ago, and I'd always gone p past this bike place. Uh, I got a flatty there, they fixed it for me, and I thought, I wonder if they've got bikes there. It's only small. I went there, um, the owner threw a good bit of sign language, pointed across the road, diagonal on the intercept. He said, there's our big storage uh, shop, have a look. Bugger me if I, um, I go over, and he had the same bike in there. Now, it's a new bike, old stock. So there's a bit of rust on the um, guards. They're a bit rough. And a bit of, ru a bit of rust on just the top of um, the bracket here for the guard. Now that's, it's, 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 yeah, it comes off, it comes off. Um, so I didn't, Oh, I didn't muck around uh, how much and I ended up getting it for three million now this other bike was going to cost me 4.6 had the money the guy you know it's not a flash bike but it's 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 a step up um, certainly from the single speed uh, so hey you know by not stressing out and getting wound up um, and just not not going with the flow dead fish go with the flow don't go with the flow go against it um, swim your own bloody tide uh, but just by okay you're asleep you don't want my money see it uh, no worries boom again something else happens by just letting things letting things happen but me taking taking uh, charge and going looking again and this just presented itself uh, so I brought it and um, I went back to the guy. So here we go. Here we go. This is what it's all about here. Um, I'm a bit of a trendsetter here in uh, in Hoi An. Um, the box on the back got a lot of attention to the point where it got a little bit too much attention, and I don't like too much attention. Um, <laughs> positive attention, but attention nevertheless, and I'm not here for that. Um, so uh, I've, I, I've done what I consider a first here. I've seen nothing like it. I don't think I don't think many um, roadies or travellers or, or have done this. I haven't seen it anywhere. But here, let me explain here. So I've taken the front basket. Now these are front baskets. This is a front basket. There's the bracket there that normally goes on, not on these bikes because they don't have the brackets. But those front baskets go on the front of bikes. You've all seen them. All the hotel bikes, um, the city bikes, and the single speeders, you can put front baskets on them. Um, so what I've done is I've, I've put two on the back, pannier style, saddlebags, guys. 
Yeah, cool. Strong too. So the existing frame, the existing carrier that I have here, frame goes down. So I've just got some um, some other. These are the brackets that normally hold it to the front. I've bent them up and um, bolted them on. One there and uh, bent bent these up, bolted them on, and I'm good to go. Now I can get all my shopping in there when I go to the market, a couple of watermelons, um, I chuck my bag in, I carry tools, I'll show you. Uh, you won't be able to see this, but maybe you can see some surface rust there. I'll, if I have to, I'll sand it and spray paint it. Um, so I went back to the, old, the, the, the guy there at the shop, and um, I was getting a sore ass on the seat here. It's one of those racy jobs. So I got a softy. hasn't haven't changed much because it's sloping down, but it's a fixed bracket, and I can't change the angle on it. I need it up a bit so because I'm sliding forward, and the old ghoulies there get caught on 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 the front, like you know. Uh, and I brought a light because you need a light. So I got that. That's on full half full and I've got a flasher so I'm a flasher now I'm a flasher on wheels um, got a horn a uh, little wire here now this I won't do it there's four different sounds there you go and um, what else I've got a backlight and the reason I got these is, is for the obvious uh, half the people riding around right or wrong doesn't matter don't use their lights if they're not using their lights, then they don't have it to be looking out for anyone else that is either. It doesn't work that way here. Um, that's tight. So, uh, you know, I'm an ex-big bike rider, and I know it's not about what you can see, it's about who can see you. So I've got this little backlight here. I'll turn her on. There you go. We're in the daytime. Uh, got some little flashies there. There's another one. Chair, like a Mack truck. Turn it off. It's off. Reflectors. Um, so that just allows people to see me. You know, the, the obvious. It, it just just helps a bit. Shit happens. Now, so there we go. I'm all good to go now. Um, so. What I did when I um, what I did when I rented not rented when I had hotel bikes is uh, they'd have a few of them. I'd pick the best for me. Um, the last place I put new pedals on and new brakes because they were they were stuffed. Um, this lot here, this seat, front light, back light, a uh, grand total of uh, 220 dong. Um, 10 bucks US um, and I brought some tools now I've had these for a while because where I've had free bikes I've maintained them for the people and um, and I've, I've gone over their other bikes and just tightened stuff up no problem uh, I can do it so I've got a few ringies Got a few ringies. These cover every nut and bolt on the bike. Um, yeah, so that's it. Uh, that's me, uh, California City 300. It's good. Um, I, I carry. Uh, I got a little pump someone gave me, and I've got um, some silicon spray for the chain. And um, but it's those, it's it's these, it's these here. I'm interested in seeing who copies that, and good on them if they do, because uh, that's a winner. And it also gets the weight off the front, because any weight on the front, I was noticing that my steering, I was, I was um, it was under steering too much. So with the weight off the front now, I get good steering around a, a tight corner or a quick corner if I want. Uh, and the weight on the back, obviously, you know, just it just disperses the weight. It can take it, 
Um, I'm not worried about what it's supposed to rate it at, but I, I could put 20, k, 20 kg on the back there, no problem. Uh, just pump the tyre up a bit. So that's it, we've done it. I'm away, I'm up and rolling. Um, it's a good spot here. Now over there's the uh, Anbang Beach, not far, a couple of kilometres. Uh, I've been over there. Haven't been for a swim yet. There you go. Uh, that's that's me, Frangipani. We'll give one more nose, nose into the into the flower. I mean, these are just th these are just knockout fra knockout fragrance here. Now my friend Boo is visiting her family. She'll like that. So here's a, here's a smell for you, Boo. <laughs> Alright, see ya, cool, turning off.